Hi everybody. All right, it is time for solar upgrade, getting a new battery. So about six months ago, we replaced our, our bad batteries. I bought the wrong kind. I didn't buy true deep cycles. I bought AGMs, but they weren't deep cycle. I thought all AGM batteries were deep cycle batteries. Well, they weren't specific for the RV, and so they went bad in like 10 months. But luckily I bought them at Sam's Club. So I took them back and um, they didn't have my same battery so they gave me my money back. So I replaced it with one of these guys here, one of these Duracells. Um, it's a 115 amp hour battery and with being in the sun all the time we had no problem. It worked great. But now that it's getting so hot in Colorado it's not working so great anymore. It is just too hot in here. And so uh, we found parks with lots of shade trees, but we needed the sun every day to charge just this one battery. And so today I went out and I bought a second battery. Same kind, everything's perfectly equal. And um, let's get this thing put in because I definitely, we definitely need it if we're gonna be in the shade for most of the afternoon. Um, and be watching shows and be using our laptop and stuff. And I already had all this wiring ready because I had two batteries before and I just duct taped or um, electrical taped the heck out of this one here, the, the hot, so that it wouldn't, um, so that it wouldn't spark or anything. And now we'll be able to find those shady trees and feel comfortable just sitting right underneath them for a long time. And I know this looks like a mess. Everything, everything is red or orange. Um, it's because I used 16 gauge, 16 gauge extension cord and I doubled them all up and I used all six strands, three strands from each cord, I used all six strands to make one. And uh, I looked on the charts and did the math and for what I'm pulling that's more than enough, um, that's more than enough uh, cable. These two is way is plenty. And I actually did a test like running, like really maxing it out with like a, um, a coffee maker or I mean a, a t electric teapot that I had handy. And um, even, uh, and just to make sure no warmth in the wires and it was really fine, no warmth at all. And um, I've done this before, I did this, I also did this in the school bus with uh, very good success. Um, no issues and over a year there and there we actually did have some good strong appliances and so uh, I don't know if I truly needed both sets of those all six they're all the same color but everything like that says negative inverter every every single set has a label on it so I can track down what's to what since there's it's kind of confusing and kind of a mess but um, there it is folks I got a new system and, or a new system. I got a, a new battery and I've just doubled our amp hours to 230 amp hours and uh, now we can be in the shade all afternoon and maybe watch a movie or something and not worry about running out of juice because we had an underpowered battery system for our 320 watts of power. Uh, I will put a link here so you can see me building the system out on my other chan on the other channel I shared with my wife when I first built it out last year. I'll put a link here to that so you can see my full build out of this solar system here in the Sprinter. All right, everyone, bye. Have a great day. I guess I'll let you see the whole thing. How about we see this whole thing, everybody? My two batteries in, in parallel, 12 volt. There's my charge controller, not the expensive one, but it's done a great job. 3,000 or 2,000 watt inverter 
that we don't really need anymore because we don't use it. And then we have our little inverter up there. Right up there, that's our little inverter, 300 watt, which does a great job. It's a really good one. It's the pure sine wave. It's so nice for just for what little we use. It's the perfect setup. So we have the big inverter if I, if I want to run big power tools every once in a while. And then a little power strip on the side to plug stuff into. And that's the whole system. Bye, everyone.